Why am I going gray? The top four causes of gray hair. Your first gray hair pops up and you think, should I pluck it? Then you decide that you shouldn't pluck it because you heard somewhere, who knows where, that every time you pluck one gray hair, it turns into 10 more. So you don't pluck it. But a few weeks later, not 10, but 30 to 50 more gray hairs pop up and you're faced with a life-changing decision on whether to dye it or not. You choose not to because you're a bad mother who isn't afraid of change. But now you're faced with other questions, like what to use on your hair, how to style it, and most pressing, what's causing my hair to turn gray. The answer to what causes gray hair is layered and sometimes overlapping. Most think it's something that comes with old age, maturity, or stress. They'd all be right, but that doesn't mean that's what's causing your gray hair. If that were the case, how do we explain Silver Fox college students? And how do you explain seniors still rocking their original hair color having never gone gray? In short, it's objective. And the only way to find the culprit to trace back to what's causing your gray hair is based on you as an individual. Here are a few places to start to find out what's causing your gray hair. Genetics. Hair does not go gray. It grows gray. Hair does not turn gray. It grows gray. And what causes a person's hair to grow gray depends on several factors based on your individual lifestyle. Once a hair follicle produces hair, the color is already determined. As one ages, your hair may produce less melanin, which explains the link between old age and gray hair. However, this process is subjective to genetics. Looking at your elders and when they began going gray may give you more insight into when your gray hair began or will begin coming in. Vitamin deficiency. You are what you eat. And just as the vitamins and minerals in our food affect our bodies, they also have an effect on our hair and skin. Nutritional deficiencies affect the pigmentation of our hair, causing it to grow thinner, more brittle, and ultimately gray. Vitamins that contribute to the overall health of our hair are B6, B12, biotin, and vitamin D and E. Not getting enough of these nutrients can cause premature gray. On the contrary, reincorporating these vitamins into your diet can reverse gray. Chemicals, dyes, and hair products. We've provided a list of the most harmful chemicals for gray hair. Chemicals such as alcohol, parabens, and sulfates harm not just gray hair, but all hair. If you were heavily using the products on our avoid list, there's a chance that they played a role in your hair going gray and will only further damage it and decrease melanin production. Another major player in stripping hair of melanin is hydrogen peroxide, which is found in hair dyes. Anything that is meant to strip hair of its color will do just that, and when used in excess can cause gray hair to be irreversible. Stress. Before our release of Embracing Your Gray in 2020, the verdict was still out on whether life stress causes gray hair. However, a 2021 study from New York University recently concluded that when under stress, the cells responsible for hair color become overworked and depleted. For years, there were conflicting reports, and the only true stress that could be linked to gray hair was oxidative stress that comes from environmental factors like pollution and smoking. No matter the cause, you have decided to embrace your gray. And we're here to equip you with the facts, tips, tricks, and a full line of hair care from Manhattan Gray.